He's gonna be so excited. Oh, hey babe. Sorry I'm late. I went and got some food with the boys after the club. It's okay. You're not gonna believe this. No. Ugh. You smell like alcohol. How many drinks did you have? I don't know. A few. What's up? Um, guess. Just tell me, Brenda. I have a headache. I don't want to play any guessing games. Maybe you should sit down. So what is it? I'm pregnant. What? Yeah, I know. Can you believe it? We're gonna have a baby. No. No. Please tell me this is some kind of a joke. I wouldn't joke about something like this. I thought you'd be more excited. Excited? Brenda, I just want to party. I want to have fun. I want to hang out with my boys. Not raise some baby. Not everything in life is about having fun and hanging out with the boys. Married for seven years. Don't you think it's time we settle down and start having a family? No! This might be what you want, but it's not what I want. First thing tomorrow, we're going to the clinic to take care of this. I'm not giving up on our baby. Well, it's either me or this baby. So make your choice. You know I can't make that decision. Fine. Then I'll go. I have the divorce paper sent to you. <laughs> the wife is devastated and can't stop crying. The husband continues to party and have fun. He hangs out with his boys and drinks every night. Over time, the wife slowly starts to regain her strength. The pregnancy gives her a new level of confidence she's never had before. As her life starts going up, the husband's life starts going down. His friends settle down and begin to have families of their own. One by one, they all disappear until the husband is left all alone. The wife ends up having her baby. She cries tears of joy, feeling so happy as she holds her daughter in her hands for the very first time. Brenda, it's been so long. I wanted to come by and see you. Hey, Roger. Is this our baby? To be honest, I haven't been able to get the two of you out of my head. And I've been thinking, maybe we could try this marriage again. I don't understand. I thought you wanted a hang out and have fun with your boys. Yeah, but they all ended up settling down and starting their own families. So it's just me now. Anyway, what do you say? Hey, honey, here's your bottle. Hey, thank you. Uh, who's your friend? Uh, this is my ex-husband, Roger. Oh. Ah, uh, nice meet. Why don't I go feed Ashley and uh, lay to catch up? I didn't realize you had a new boyfriend. Beyonce, actually. Listen, Roger, 
If you ever want to see your daughter, you're more than welcome. But as far as anything else goes, I've moved on. I needed to find a man who was ready to settle down and have a family. You take care, Roger. Hey, Darman fam, I hope you love that message. Please remember, we're not just telling stories, we're changing lives. And when you share my videos, you're helping to change lives too. I appreciate you, and I'll see you in the next video.